please may I ask that you subscribe to my channel give me a like for this video and share my videos with your girlfriends or your boyfriends too so I'm getting lots of questions in my DM what sun protection to use if you have a darker skin you guys know that most black people don't wear sun protection and we should really be wearing them and I think it's because people don't like them on their skin when we wear some of the sun cream that they sell in the shops they end up looking ashy or blue on our skin and a lot of people have said that that also put them off wearing sun cream so today I'm gonna share some of the really good sun creams that I use personally you're going to have range of sun protection to choose from okay the first sun cream that I have is from Macari you guys know that I love Macari so so much here it is it's a UV clear facial sun cream and it's got SPF of 46 that's actually a high SPF for your face this sun cream is so so good um, it's a facial sun cream so you wear it on you on your face and on your neck sometimes I extend it to my chest as you guys can see I tend to break out here and I also have some hyperpigmentation here as well if not I will grab another sun cream and put here but this one goes on my face and on my neck I really really like this so I'm gonna show you what it looks like okay that's it I don't know if you can see it so you rub it just watch that guys I know the light is interfering but you can see that totally it's gone into my skin look at that so you you're not getting any of those bluey or white patches so so good i would actually use this as my moisturizer honestly because it's not oily at all smells lovely the the fragrance is not strong at all so it's quite a mild uh, fragrance to it i don't know if you can see that look at that look at my hand can you see just look at here okay so this is perfect for your face all right so you're not going to be worried about looking ashy or looking gray or whatever especially if you don't want to wear makeup you just put this on your face as a moisturizer and keep it moving i do that and if you want to buy it make sure that you use my 15 percent discount code jane 15 so you can get money off all your macari products okay if you do not want to age prematurely and you do not want to wreck your skin make sure that you protect your skin with sun cream i've been saying this for a very long time let's start doing that ladies and gentlemen it's so important okay the next sun cream that i have that i've used in the past and i really really like it for my body not for my face but for my body is this one so it is a sun lotion from lacura this, this is actually for babies but i really really like it i used to put this on my face uh, but I only use it when I'm going running. So I put this on my face, my neck, my chest, and my arms, okay, when I'm running in the summer. It's so affordable, but it's not good to put under your makeup. It will mess up your makeup. It will make you look bluey and ashy, but it will protect your skin. So I bought this because I know that I'm only going running, and when I come back, I'm going to wash it off. I'm going to demonstrate it for you now to see. So that's what it looks like okay it has a mild gentle smell I quite like it okay so can you see so white okay my goodness still you can see the white traces it's better that you wear this than not wearing any sun protection i can't remember how much it costs but i think it's less than three pounds so the trick is to really rub it in if you've got time so it's not too bad actually now that i've moved backwards but it does leave you a little bit um let me put it on my chest so you can see Jeez, <laughs> that's gonna be interesting. Let's not show boobs, man. See, it's really white on my skin, but you know what? I'd rather have a white chest than have a damaged skin on my chest. 
say if I'm just stepping out of the house in the summer to go to Tesco's I usually wear tank tops and boot tubes in the summer I like it so I'd rather put this on it's not too bad actually yeah it's not you can see I've rubbed it in into my chest so it's, it's not too bad it's sunk into my skin now and if you dress like this in the summer for example you are exposing your skin to the sun I know you look good but you are definitely exposing your skin to some damages so wear your sunscreen if you want to buy this one buy it and also if you have a sensitive skin I would also recommend this one because it's for babies and it's factor 50 it's a high factor remember that you have to top it up okay so I think every four hours you reapply especially if you're under the sun if you're in a picnic or just out for a very long time make sure that you reapply if you keep on topping this up you might just end up looking white it's up to you but I'm gonna share another sunscreen that might be better for topping up instead of this one it's a clear sun spray SPF of SPF of 30 good for sensitive skin and obviously will protect you from the sun let's try this one on I'm gonna think of sunscreen but it's, oh hang on a minute this one I haven't actually used it before I picked it up Can you see it? I would not put this on my face. Do not put this on your face, okay? Just on your body. It doesn't look bad at all. <laughs> I'm glowing. It's a bit greasy, but not too greasy. It's like the it's like the body oil and it has um, a smell to it. It's a nice smell, but I think it might interfere with your perfume if you care about stuff like that. So that's it. Again, with this one, it's only 30 SPF. If you're out and about and you're going to be outside for a very long time, you might need to top it up. My final choice of sun protection that I'm going to be sharing with you guys is one that I found on Amazon because it was recommended to me. This is from Garnier, Garnier Ambassador, and it's sensitive, advanced, factor 50, and you can spray this on your makeup. Remember I said that if you are wearing even factor 50, you have to top up every four hours. I'm not sure if it's four hours, so I will double check that. Either two, either two or four hours, I'm not sure. But you definitely need to top up your sun cream. And with this particular one, you can actually spray it over your makeup. It's a dry mist, so it's not going to leave anything on your makeup. According to the lady that I've used it, I've not used it before. But it is in my basket in Amazon, and I'm going to get it for myself. Because if we go out... When the lockdown is over and I know that I'm going to be going out, I would need to have this in my handbag so that I can reapply over my makeup. I do not want the sun to damage my skin at all. I keep looking at it because it's on my phone. I need to order it. It's 11 pounds on Amazon. So it's not too bad at all. Uh, I'm going to leave the link in the description box below. If you want to buy that, go and get that for yourself for over your makeup and under your makeup it's really good this one so in our collection today you've got the one that will not leave your skin blue or gray and will not break you out and it's not greasy which is the Macari one it's my number one and I really really like it you've got a cheap and cheerful one that will also protect you especially when you're going exercising or you're running or you're out in the Sun shopping that will protect you and when you come back home you wash it off so you don't have to worry too much about that one and you've got one that you spray under your makeup as well as over your makeup so you're spoiled for choice 
all you have to do now is go out and get yourself a sun cream i know that we're not going out but we do step out of the house so yeah it's entirely up to you that's it for today i will see you again very soon but don't forget to like share and also subscribe to my channel take care and please stay safe love you lots Mwah. bye